just when you thought you'd seen it all, here I am with the Thie IE7 action camera. Here's the box, another view, new style. Let's open it up and take a look at what's inside. Here's the camera in its waterproof casing, put that to one side, and let's take a look at some of the accessories. There's adhesive mounts, a USB cable, more adhesive mounts, an extra skeleton back door, another quick release buckle, anti-fog inserts, the all-important cleaning cloth, and a bag. Okay, now let's go ahead and crack open this bad boy, take out the camera from the waterproof casing, and let's take a look at how to operate it. And this is what the E7 looks like along the front, and then along the back, of course, we have the screen, it's like that, and then on the top we have this Wi-Fi button, which is also the button to begin shooting. Then along the side we have the micro SD card slot, and also two ports for micro USB and HDMI. Then along the bottom we have the quarter inch threaded insert. Just beside that is the housing for the battery. You can see I've already got one in here. So all I need to do now is slot in a little micro SD card. I have one with me here and then I can switch it on and begin shooting. To switch it on, I'll be holding down this power button located along the front and wait till that blue light switches on. There we go. And we can see it is on. The screen is showing the display of what's coming through that camera. And as I mentioned before, there's a button at the top to begin shooting. So I'm gonna press that now and away we should go. We got the red light indicator at the top of our screen there telling me that I've begun shooting. It's just as easy as that. So now what I'll do is take you through a few of the different options of this camera to show you what different functions it has. So how to get in through that? We just tap the power button again, no need for long press, just a little quick tap, boom, like that, and it changes the mode. And then tap it again, and we're into the menu screen. And then how to uh, scroll around the different options, you use these arrows here, the up and down arrows, photo playback, video setting, photo setting, camera setting. So let's go ahead and just give that a little click at the moment. Ooh, and it's got different options, power frequency, sounds, etc. There you can see all the various options you have. Go back, press the power button. This is top button to select, power button to go back. And I'm even going to see if we can check out the video settings to have a look at how to change the video resolution because that's one of the most important features of this action camera you get different options regarding the resolution tap the power button again and there you can see all those different options there and also the frame rate setting too and um, scroll down do a look at all different options okay let's just go ahead and select 19 by 20 by 1080p now 1920 by 1080p 60 fps i'm going to go ahead and select that like so and back out with this button and again and there we are ready to shoot some films now to switch the camera off what you just need to do is hold down the power button again long press just like so and wait till the screen turns off oh and it shows the brand there and the lights turn off it's off there you go and one more very funky feature of this phone is the wi-fi feature using this button at the top it's a short press if you want to start recording your videos or taking photos, but if you want to access the Wi-Fi mode, then what you have to do is hold it down for a little bit longer, and it'll take you there, just like it's about to do now. Look at that. I don't know if we'll remove this later, but there it is. So, waiting for Wi-Fi connection. It's got the username and the password there. Ba -ba -ba -ba. And even a QR code for it would be very handy. Yeah, it's good, yeah. Oh.